Today we are going to go over the basics of the AccuScope EXC120 microscope. To start, make sure the microscope is plugged in and in the on position. Your microscope comes with a set of objective lenses. Here are a 4x, 10x, 40x, and 100x. Two 10x eyepieces are shown to the left and are used to view samples at 10 times the rating of the objective. This means that 4x shows an image at 40 times its size, 10x shows an image at 100 times its size, 40x shows an image at 400 times its size, and 100x shows an image at 1000 times its size. When changing between objectives, always use the rubber gripper to move the nose piece. Never grab the objectives to move. You may unintentionally unscrew one or dirty the lenses if touched. Even a tiny smear can make the whole image blurry when magnified. Inserting and removing slides are easy. Simply hold open the slide holder to remove, or glide the new slide into position atop the stage. Be mindful not to touch a part of your slide containing the specimen. To bring your image into focus, use the coarse and fine adjustments on either side of the microscope. The coarse adjustment is used for large, rapid movement of the stage. The fine adjustment is used for very precise, fine movement of the stage. The fine adjustment is ideal for focusing between objectives once clarity is first achieved through the 4x objective. It is good practice to start at the 4x and work your way up. Slides are typically made of glass and are very fragile. Never use the coarse adjustment at higher magnifications to locate your specimen. You could risk damaging the slide, microscope, or even yourself. Everyone's interpupillary distance is different and can be accommodated as shown. For individual eye adjustment, you can first focus on a point of the slide using your right eye through the fixed position eyepiece. Then adjust the left to your unique prescription. The white dot indicates position. Zero is the default. Traversing the slide is done using the X and Y stalk. Similar to a graph, the x-axis travels left and right, and the y-axis travels up and down. A brightness dial is located on the side of the base. Eye sensitivity and sample type will factor into how much brightness is sufficient for optimal viewing. Whenever the microscope is not in frequent utilization, Use the provided dust cover to protect the light source and other optics from becoming dusty. An iris is located in your condenser and moves similarly to a camera's aperture. This will increase the depth of field for a sharper image. You can control the beam of your light by using the slider. This is ideal for higher magnifications. Raising and lowering of the condenser is done using the knob located under the stage. Generally, the condenser is used in its highest position. Oil immersion is used to increase the resolution and clarity of the image. To determine if your objective is designed for oil immersion, look for the word oil on the side. When ordering a microscope through AccuScope with an oil objective, you will receive a bottle of immersion oil. To add oil, position the microscope between two objectives and add a small drop over the specimen. Next, rotate to the oil objective and adjust the focus as needed. Be sure to use lens cleaning tissue when wiping any oil off your objective. Never touch any lenses on the microscope with your hands. 
Cleaning the optics will require a professional at an additional service fee. You are now ready to enter the world of microscopy with AccuScope.